Don't you let nobody turn you around, turn you around, turn you around. Don't you let nobody turn you around, keep on the cavalry. Well, I would not be reliant, tell you the reason why. Prayed my Lord might call me, I wouldn't be ready to die. Don't you let nobody turn you around, turn you around. Oh, turn, turn you around. around. Don't you let nobody turn you around, keep, keep on, on the cavalry. Well, some said Johnny was a Baptist. Some said Johnny was a Jew. The Holy Scripture really tells me that Johnny was a preacher too. Don't you let nobody turn you around, turn you around, oh, turn, turn you around. around. Don't you let nobody turn you around, keep, keep on, on the cavalry. Now John the Baptist was writing, writing for the whole of Lord. Two tall angels come stepping down and said, Johnny, don't you write no more. Don't you let nobody turn you around. You know what you're famous for? I'll tell you what you're famous for. You're the world's only talking apple. And if you keep up this silent treatment, you know what's going to happen to you? You're going to be treated like any other apple. Eaten. Or even worse, thrown into a garbage can. Now, talk. For Christ's sake, you're committing suicide here. Talk, damn it, talk. What? This is about money? For Christ's sake, you're an apple. What are you going to do with money? Where have you heard about the Briar Ritz? Did you ever hear of an apple going scan? You'll turn into a giant snowball like in the cartoons. Like on TV. What? Fucking gold digging snow bunnies. They care about only one thing. Your bank account. What? You filthy little fruit. I hardly ever get to do that. But why human beings? Why not another apple? Like a little hot Macintosh. Or one of those red deliciouses. You know what they say. An apple a day. What? I can't argue with that. So, you hear the one about the talking apple? It was right into the core. <coughs> what do you call two apples? An apple walks into a bar. I tell you, Dr. Walker, being in show business is not an easy job. I mean, every performer has his bad nights. But they don't die. Not like stand-up comedians die. I mean, on stage, you know? Tell me more about this dream you had. What more is there to tell? Would you say that you associate apples with the apple in the Garden of Eden? What? The apple that Adam and Eve ate, causing the fall, informing each of them of the knowledge of their nakedness, of sexuality. It's just a fucking apple, Doc. Hey, 
God. I used to be in show business, but I think my real calling is as a temp. Okay, now what? That's what I'm asking you, now what? 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 What do you want to know? About what? What else, me? And who are you? Really? I don't remind you of anybody? Think hard. You'll get it. You and me. I'm you, so ask me anything. I'm your future, your past, and your present. I am real. I am an illusion. I am the person you were before you were born, and the person you'll be after you die. I'm gonna die? Everybody dies. Do you want to know when? No! No! Come on. No! I'm going to tell you anyway. Okay, forget that one. What about your career? You want to know how that's going to go? Not a chance. I'm a lawyer, right? What, don't you know? You're a lawyer. Not if this is a dream. Which it is. Ouch. That's what I thought. See, I told you I was you. Ow! What did you do? Look at your arm. Now look at mine. It's a nice trick, but doesn't prove anything. Fine, then you don't mind if I tell you if you're ever going to get married or have kids or experience some tragedies. I'm not sure this isn't a dream. Oh shit, what a dream. Just so you know, you're going to disappear any second. Right after I finish this apple. Oh, and by the way, this is my dream, not yours. Not anymore. Don't you let nobody turn you around, turn you around, turn you around. Don't you let nobody turn you around and keep on the gallery. Well, I would not be the liar, tell you the reason why. Fred, my lord, might call me.